Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. So it's Wednesday again, and I think this time we're actually going to have a weekly that's completable. It's the Technophilia Challenge, which means we have all these nice equipment, but no crucifixes or smudges. But we do have the Tier 3 Sanity, which will be my first time playing around with that, which I know that gives you a speed boost. But the main thing is, we're here on Bleasdale. Oh my god, also look, I've never played around with these, so how could I do this? <laughs> Um, maybe I will just we, we only need to determine the ghost so this one like I said should be easier But I needed to keep my sanity up now. We do have this. I know everything's blurry Let me get something to go in there with I want the thermometer and then well EMF and then I, again We just need we don't need photos or anything. We just need to figure out the ghost three times So let's go in with the spirit box Now obviously I'm running in here with this and it is really blurry, but now that we're out in the dark so that's kind of the downside to this. Again, this is the first time I'm ever even using this, but it's so, so cool to have. Now we did get lucky and the breaker's right here. But I'm going to wander around, see if I can find the cursed item. It could be in here. Now I don't know if this is like professional difficulty, and look, it is the tarot card. So let's pull one and see if I get something that'll help. Okay, not much. I'll, I'll do another. And oh, moon card. That was a real moon moon card. So now I have no sanity. So let me like run outside because I have no sanity. Uh, maybe using the tarot cards wasn't that smart. But I do have like these awesome ones. So let's go. I'm using this for at, like this first game to just experiment with these new equipment. Okay, take that off for now. Mm -hmm. Now I kind of want to waste one. I know this will give me a speed boost a little bit. But I want to see how much sanity it gives me, and it should be the same amount, but it just depends on what difficulty we're on here. I want to see if it goes up to 30, which I think it's going to. Alright, then I can take a couple more, but then we'll be at 60, so I don't know. Maybe we'll get some more activity, but I'm going to go continue looking for the ghost. Maybe we will lay off the tarot cards. Now the thing is, we did turn on the breaker. Oh my god, did I... Oh, I just heard a door too. I would have dropped the thermometer in here. Oh my god, I do such a bad job of keeping track of my equipment. Now, did I leave my thermometer at the truck? Oh god, let me go look. Okay, my first thermometer is missing now, so I'm gonna go get the other one. But we already heard a door on the first floor, so we have an idea. And as I was saying, the breaker's on, so we will, we will find this room. But should I? Oh, see, ah! Uh... I gotta really pay attention to when I drop stuff. Oh well. At least we found it. Now there was a door over here that got touched. I think it's on this side. Let me scan these rooms. You do lose a little bit of your vision when you're in these goggles. Oh my god, that one was so loud. Oh. So yeah, I kind of figured that was through the wall. Let me go. Oh, well, maybe I shouldn't take these off. So you are another hallway ghost. But I do like this being right here. So I kind of want to step outside. Now we do have some stuff. Oh, I should have like checked EMF for that. Let's get back in here. That's a hunt. Oh well. And she probably detected me. Well, uh, you know what? The tarot cards. <laughs> I'm fine with this because I was really just using this first game to experiment with the new equipment that I've never even used. So, <laughs> okay. If you don't find me, it's normal speed. I assume this is like professional difficulty. How have you not found me here? I don't know how you didn't detect me with my EMF going off. We're getting super lucky. Uh, I don't even... I really wish I hadn't used the tarot cards. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? Are you far? Are you friendly? Are you here? Are you close? I don't think, well, I don't even know if it's detecting my mic now. Well, let me go get something else in here and also maybe just take the last sanity and see if I can get the evidence easily with this. We know it's normal speed, so maybe that'll help me in the end, but let me just get the other evidence in here. Okay, well, hunted, well wow, it hunted right at range. Ah, 45, okay, it was definitely under then. I'm gonna take one. I don't think I'll bring the other one with me. Honestly, I should have just ignored the tarot cards, maybe even ignored the night vision. I mean, the night vision's alright, it didn't really screw me over. But I'm gonna look for orbs, maybe UV, 
and then dots, and is that everything we need in there? I believe it is. Okay, I'm just hoping the breaker is on. I don't see any lights on, but it did just hunt, and I definitely have not turned on one. Oh, see, I really kind of like the light a little bit more. Oh, but this is cool. Now, the thing is, here we go again with another hallway ghost. So I'm going to have to get in dots, multiple dots, to cover this whole area, but this is good for now. Should be looking for ghost orbs. Should now be scanning. I kind of wish I would brought a tripod, but this- oh my god. I'm, I'm afraid of getting hunted. But we got UV. No Bake fingerprints. And it... How? <laughs> For one, how am I alive? <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going upstairs. I can barely see it's so dark. She saw me. I don't know how I'm alive. I'm really trying to see through the dark. I can't see. I mean, my, mo my monitor. <laughs> it's just so dark. Okay. Is this a demon? It could be. It seemed really angry. And I just took sanity, so I really should be... That was definitely an early hunt. Now, okay, maybe I can use my night vision to get back. <laughs> Perfect. No, I don't have any reason to be up here. Mm -hmm. Thankfully, there's no breaker. I'm gonna get back. I think this is a demon just by how that felt. <laughs> so let's... Well, we don't have a crucifix, of course. So, oh please, let me just get out for a second. Now, I think a demon will be freezing. So I need to check the... I need to check that temperature again. Wouldn't be dots. Wouldn't be ghost orbs. What would it be? Writing. Okay. Uh, since we don't need the UV... Let's go in with writing. Let me check my sanity. Because that'll determine how much of an early hunt that one was. Yeah, 65, so... I think, uh... Does Obake hunt early? See, I gotta still remember all these hunt ranges. But okay. Gonna get a book in there, which... Oh, wait! Is the... Oh, because the book's not technology. Well, my guess then is gonna be demon. But we can look for the freezing. That's funny, though, because I was just thinking we had so much stuff. That's the one thing we didn't have is the writing. Oh, wait. Right. I'm gonna take sanity, but... Oh, we might just die this time going in there. Yeah, since we don't have writing, the only thing I can do is look for freezing. So I'm just gonna go in here, see if we get hunted again. But that very first hunt, it felt aggressive. Now, we were in range, I believe, the very first time it hunted. But it felt really aggressive. So we just found its room and then it was not happy. Now again, I gotta remember where I threw all this crap down. It is super active. Yeah, it's a demon. Just... Just by the fact that it hunted early. I don't think a Hantu can hunt early. Oh, Mimic though. Yeah, I do have time to scan for ghost orbs. I think I'd see... Let's turn this off. I think I'd see ghost orbs even with my night vision on here. Now, you've been hanging out over here, but that doesn't mean you're not over here. But does that- is this a workshop? Is this like a different room? I guess it is. Because my breath isn't cold over here. So no ghost orbs, so it doesn't look like it's gonna be a mimic, thankfully. I do think this is a demon. And if we just get hunted again randomly, we're gonna know for sure. That's kind of what I want to test. Hey, uh, who is this? Becky, can you hunt me, please? Maybe she's listening. I do love this night vision though. Next game, I'm going to remember, I did this last weekly where I just used the cursed item when if it's a small map like this, I really should just walk around looking for the ghost. By the way, yeah, it's pitch black in here without the night vision, so it's just funny, like I'm forgetting about being in the light and oh, <laughs> not Noni. Okay, I, the thing is, you're not going to be like early hunting because now my sanity is in the drain. Well, I'm going to get hunted here. Probably just die. But, uh, are you here? Give us a sign. Oh, you knocked over this. Come on, Becky. Show yourself. See? I just turned off my night vision. I'm gonna hide here. See, I know the power of this island. If I just kind of like loop, oh my god, <laughs> I might as well take this time to try and like learn some strategies. 
I really did not know this island was so powerful and like blocking line of sight like this is so good. I think she went back upstairs looking for me. Alright, well so much for getting killed. I don't mind like trying to survive a little bit. Oh! Okay, I guess you are done. Okay, well, I forgot about the tarot cards. Let's go grab the tarot card and see what happens. See if we get a high priestess or something. I really need to figure out these doors. There's got to be some trick to learn which way they go. I just like rely on muscle memory, but I really need to just pay attention to which way the doors open. Now what do we get? Oh, nothing. I'm great. What are you... Even if it's a normal tower card, I don't want it. Oh, okay. There's all my sanity. Can I do anything with it? <laughs> tower card. Get out of here. Banging. Oh, just a... Same thing that happened earlier. Wheel of Fortune, I can't even tell what color that is. And another one, and don't know- man, nothing fun. Then, okay, wait, if I'm at super high sanity, then I guess if I get hunted, that's really gonna determine. But the breaker's been out and I've been in the dark so long. Let's try and wait for another hunt, but I'm gonna go over here, turn the breaker on, and see what it looks like around here with the lights on. Well, do you hear that? You're just going crazy over here, aren't you? What's- Oh, it's this boot being thrown around. I really don't know all the new sounds. Let's turn on this light. I wanted to see how bad it is, and it's actually kind of alright even if you have lights on. I forget this door is here. This is also a nice door. Wow, I really do forget there's like an exit door right here in this room. I was thinking like, oh, that's the, door, the good door, but there's one right here. There's also one in the living room, which is really strange to think about. I never really use them too often to escape the house. Yeah, you're touching the doors again. Alright, ghost. I kind of want you to kill me. But, uh, you're not acting really like a demon now. You did turn off the breaker. Normal speed, and it's been the same every time, and no ghost orbs. So really, this is a demon. It's just funny, like the... Oh my god, I did get... W w oh, you were small. How? I guess I didn't even see what model you were. But I, I just, of course, get a ghost that doesn't have the writing, so this ends up being like a nightmare kind of run. Would you stop throwing that? I was hoping we did get a bunch of sanity and then I don't know what happened with the Wheel of Fortune. I think we're at good sanity. So I'm, I'm just waiting for an early hunt. Yeah, I'm just assuming my sanity is still good even after the, those two cards. Oh my god. Eight under. Oh yeah, there's a little lamp here to turn on. Oh, uh... Would've been fun to test this with crucifixes too. And no way it's a haunt I'm Cause it's been in cold rooms. I mean, I'll, I'll definitely test it during a hunt in here, see how fast it is. But when I was hiding, yeah, it was normal speed the whole time. And this is definitely the room with how cold it is. And we're not seeing orbs. The thing is though, the orbs apparently only appear around the ghost. So maybe you're like bringing your ghost orbs in this room or something. Not on top of me, please. What about in here? Oh my god, I forgot. Like, the first thing you did was that giggle. Do you like this room? I don't see my breath. I saw it a little bit as I walked in here. Well, it's not early hunting. I wanted to do it to do its ability. Can you play with this? Give us a sign. Well, so much for it feeling like a demon. Zoo, so, what was that now? I thought I heard stomping. This is out. So is that something the ghost can do? <laughs> My original EMF over here. Let's blow that out. I think it can. Because the breaker's on, but now that thing's blown out. I wonder if you can, like, relight it. Okay, ghost Becky, please. I need one last hunt. I really just want to die here. I kind of want to see what it looks like if the ghost is coming at you during a hunt with the night vision on. Because I know it gets blurry, but still, I want to see what it looks like. And I'm going to see if you're fast or still normal speed. It seems like normal. Ah, I should actually put in demon. Well, again, we're on the weekly, so it doesn't matter if I die. God, this game it really does look better now that I've turned up the... I turned up shadows and, like, the anti-aliasing. Please, <laughs> demon? I don't think uh, this. I don't feel like it's a demon. Okay, thank God it was. 
I mean, I could have, I was looking for some other, but I kind of stopped looking for dots, didn't I? Okay, there's one down. Let's try and get these other two. Okay, so of course we have the breaker in the attic, and it's snowing, so I'm going to <laughs> go up to the attic. I'm going to ignore the cursed item. I'm going to turn on the breaker and wait for it to warm up, but it's going to be a little harder to find a cold room this time. But I do, I don't know. To make this easier, this game, I'm going to try not to use that. So I'm going to go use the flashlight and then this. So let's try and go find the ghost room. Oh, wow. See, I was trying to turn on my headlight. Well, this... Okay, found the ghost. This is why I love small maps. I recently again heard, apparently this is the biggest small map in tarot cards again. Oh my god, are you playing in the kitchen? Or are you playing in here? Oh, well, in breath, it's snowy. I think you're in the kitchen. Mm, you're either well, you're on one side of this wall. That sounded like a cup. Are you whoa? <laughs> oh, you're hiding. <laughs> That's supposed to be my hiding spot. Oh god, you're telling me you know where I'm gonna be hiding. Do I just drain my sanity? You're doing that head twisty thing again. I think it's in this room. Oh oh. What did it do? Did it touch the door? Now it's gone. Okay, well I do want to get the breaker on. So I'm still going to go up there, and maybe I'll look for a hiding spot. So what about in here? I know they're... Yeah, see that? Yeah, they consider that a hiding spot that's worth blocking, so... That's a spot that I need to remember could be open and worth going to. But other than that, it's all going to be in the attic. So I don't know about hiding, I might just be looping. But as we know, don't get too close right there. So let's get this breaker on, and I'm going to head back down there. Alright, so once again, I don't really even look at the name or the objectives because it's not even worth it. But I will look, it's Betty Myers. Also, did we get an objective already? I witnessed a ghost event, so... You get a little bit of extra money. That's why it's a one-time multiplier, so you don't make that much, because you technically can... make money while not losing items while doing the challenge, so you could farm, like, a small amount of money by just doing it at one time. Also, I see this is on. Now, I may have done that as I was leaving. And also has hiding spots. There goes that breaker. I worked so hard to get turned on. Let's go look for the hiding spot back here. I want the locker to be open. No. <laughs> As we saw, hiding back there is not too bad of a spot. The ghost didn't come in here far enough, so... But let me see. Yes, okay. I'm happy with that. I'm gonna walk out here, though, so we don't drain much more sanity. So maybe what I'll do is just go ahead and drop this stuff at the door and go ahead and get the three other items I can carry in here. Hmm, look at that, there's a bottle rolled all the way over there. So this ghost it looks like one of the entrance ghosts. And you know what, this living room, I hope it is in the living room. I always like the living room ghost for some reason. I think it's because it's near the TV. I just love it being able to interact with that. Sanity's good. So maybe this one won't be as... Crazy as the last one, which I'm surprised we even got that last one right. There was a moment there I really thought we were gonna just fail that last ghost. Let's bring in the dots and hope for the best. Now I want to... Oh, we'll just scan for ghost orbs. Now I think... I actually don't know. Let's stand here. I see my breath in that room, but will I see my breath in this room with the breaker on? I think even with it snowy, the rooms will warm up enough. So yes, it looks like it is going to be this room. I'm going to try and put this here. Hmm, seems like a good spot. Oh, that damn breaker's not on. There goes my desk again. I don't know if my microphone picked that up, but my desk makes weird noises every once in a while and it's terrifying. I saw my breath. Was it in here? I don't like that I'm just walking around in the dark. Let's set this up on the wall and let it scan. We have sanity, so I can take sanity. It's just I don't want to let it get too low here. I'm gonna maybe drop this by the door so we can scan the door. And then I wanna get upstairs, so I'm gonna take my light. Uh, actually, I really should focus on- I, I have so much sanity. I wanna see if it's down in the freezing. Now I can scan EMF. Oh my god, that kinda sounded like a poltergeist. It is going nuts in here. Was that a poltergeist? Well, there's so many different ones. It's been throwing a lot, but I don't have a- Evidence. And I think it's roaming in here. I don't think this is its favorite room, but it's hanging out in here right now. So with it being this throwaway, maybe by getting a hunt I can redeem myself and actually determine it properly. 
Mm, okay, since we didn't get EMF-5, I'm dropping all my evidence in here. I'm gonna go turn that breaker on, hope it lasts a while. I know I could rule out Jin. In there. But let me get the breaker back on. So yeah, I'm very glad that we're not on a large map again. I think even if the... This is a combination of a small map and a pretty easy challenge with the equipment. This equipment's very good. Even without crucifixes, I can still just keep taking uh, sanity. And I have the meter, so I know what my sanity is, so... This one feels way better, but even if I had, like, a harder challenge, like... With lesser equipment, I really just need a small map. Because I can be pretty alright on a small map. I'm just kind of afraid of having to deal with a bigger map. Why? Oh, you're just gonna stand there? Where, where's your hair? There goes the hair again. This is supposed to be the Patient 7 model, which... I've recently learned that's the official name. Actually, when I started playing this game, they had just introduced that model, so that model really does have a special place in my heart. But you need to be hanging out over here, please, Betty. Let's see if it's fast. Seems a little faster, or is that normal speed? I think that's normal speed. Ooh. Kinda sounds like a polter throwing rapidly there. So I recently kinda heard a poltergeist <laughs> watching someone play. And I think I kinda have a better understanding of it, but it this feels like a poltergeist, so what would be the evidence? I recently looked this up. Zero box UV and writing. So no again writing. I wonder if this challenge like favors ghost writing ghosts. So let me get out of here. Let's use a spirit box and UV. We have the UV in there. Let's get spirit box and also check my sanity and see if that was an early hunt. It did repeatedly throw there, but I don't know exactly because <laughs> I've already tricked myself. I used to think I understood the para or the poltergeist rapid throw during a hunt, but I got it wrong last time. But yeah, we're under 50, so I can take one of these now. See, now I didn't have to deal with a tarot card, so this challenge isn't that bad. So this is, like I said, a combination of a small map and good equipment. So this one is way on the easier side. But I'd like to have a small map where, you know, there's a lesser equipment challenge. I'm still learning, like, all the actual weekly challenges. Oh, you know what? I see these uh, motion sensors, too. I get to... This is a cool way of getting to, like, the tier 3 equipment if you don't have them unlocked. And, of course, I brought my flashlight. So let's bring... Why is that door closed? Did I go out the other way? I guess I did. Okay, that would explain it. But I haven't played around with these. And another thing I kind of know about them is that when you put them down... Oh, it's right next to that light. You can kind of find where the ghost is when you put them down. So let's see if we can find where the ghost currently is. When you put them down... I, I doubt they patched this yet. May, they may do this one day. But when you put it down, if it's in the range of the ghost, it's supposed to detect it. <laughs> but there doesn't seem to be a ghost around here. Maybe we'll just put it right down in the middle and see if you walk by. This sucks though, where are you? Maybe you... I don't think you like this room anymore. I think your favorite room is actually in here. Maybe you never liked this room, and maybe you always preferred this room, because this is where we first started our hearing stuff to begin with. Alright, getting stuff in here then. Oh, was it freezing or am I going nuts? I think it was just down to two, not negative two. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you far? Are you close? We'll come back to this. Yeah, you've been throwing so much stuff, but you haven't really touched a door. Mmm, no salt, too, because we guess what? We don't have anything that isn't technology. We only love the technology this time. Before, I did like... Well, I think I missed the primitive one. Where did that come from? I mean, I know this is really close to your room. UV, I think this is going to be a poltergeist. Not over here again. I really should get, like, another hunt. So, okay, since you're in here... What can I do to further prove this is the poltergeist? Oh, get the, uh, spirit box, which... Oh, God. Do I have it on me? Ooh, here. But you touched a door over here. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? So I swear this door just got touched. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? Are you here? 
Are you friendly? Maybe. Oh, it just touched it through the wall, didn't it? Are you here? Are you friendly? Yeah, this is pretty obviously gonna be the poltergeist, but this time, let me. I'm gonna get hunted and definitely make sure. No, oh, but what other things could we rule out? Can't be ghost orbs. No. Yeah, okay. We're just gonna say it's poltergeist. So let's try and see how long it takes to get hunted here. Now, I don't even know what the cursed item is. Maybe I should. Was that an event or just you being annoying? See, sometimes when it turns off the light, it doesn't leave UV, but it can't even remotely be a bake. Oh, mimic? Because I didn't scan. See, I'm glad I didn't just like assume this. I had this done right. If it gave me a ghost orb, that would really throw things off. We could like this room though. I'm still leaning towards it being poltergeist, but I really need to make sure we don't get ghost orbs. And yeah, since we don't have that, that's gonna really increase the odds of it being the bolty. And the thing is, I really just need another hunt. And well, let's go travel up to the breaker again. Unless I'm just turning off all the lights. Oh, I am. Okay. Hmm. I'm just tricking myself. I just I thought like I had a light on in there, but we did not. All right, ghost, give us a sign. Okay, I guess that's good enough. Can I scan EMF? That's a whoa, that's a four on that. So maybe these are like events that are getting bugged and I'm not seeing the Vesuvius. I never noticed that. Anyway, I'm really just trying to get hunted here. Oh, we knew it was the tarot cards again. So let's go pull the tarot cards for fun. I really want to get hunted in here and just see if I can... We haven't heard of Poltergeist ability. Okay, so it can't be Ghost Orb. So Mimic ruled out. What? Dots. Maybe it's a phantom. Let's get two dots in here. I don't want to just, you know, screw this up. So we have determined that this is the cold room. Please. Oh, oh. See, that looked like dots again. That didn't look like my breath. That happened before where I really thought I saw dots. We're gonna stick around. We're gonna get the other dots projector in here. Is this still the cold room? I might have to get a photo cam. Oh, you went through here. Let me see if I can get outside. I'm gonna turn on this light. Okay. So there's still things I need to do. Here I am thinking it's a poltergeist, but I really need to see if it's dots. And I, I really put that down and it looked like I got it again. And that happened before, and I don't want to be wrong here. So I'm going to get a camera in case we see the ghost. My sanity, ah, uh, I don't know. I'm going to take one. We have another, well, we have two more. So yeah, I should definitely take one. Can I get the sensors in there? And yeah, the other dots. So we'll get two sensors in there and see if the ghost is, will stay in its room. And maybe at higher sanity, the ghost will stay in its room. Because that's apparently a thing where if the lower your sanity, the more roamy the ghost becomes. So, alright. I want to get this other dots on the other side. And just that way we have the whole room. Yeah, there's a plate. I mean, we that's the thing. We haven't heard the poltergeist ability. And that's what makes me think this is not it. But maybe there just haven't, haven't been enough things or together. Like, there's so many things on this table that can't be interacted with. Like, all this stuff should be interactable, really. I'm gonna check this again just to see if you're really nearby. I mean, you're probably not even nearby. Oh. Are you here? Oh, okay. And that was the other one. I wonder if putting this up here is... Uh, don't even let me... I'm gonna put it like, like here, so that way like we'll know if it leaves. I mean, you are in this room. Now I don't, of course, don't have the writing book to determine, but we'll be here long enough to see if we get dots. And yeah, I need to stand in the dots because what it'll do is it'll roam to me with its dots. So I need to stand somewhere where I'll see it properly. <laughs> that fan, I do not need that fan going off in my ear. But I'm gonna stand in here. We have good sanity and we're in the light. Where was that? Oh, look at it. It's following it. That is so cool, man. I can't wait to like unlock this stuff and get to experiment it with it on my own. But it's tracking the ghost all in here and it's also walking around in the dots entirely. So 
At least I'm actually trying to figure this out. And I do not think it's dots. I think I put down the dots and I was standing right in front of it, so I saw my breath in the dots. I'm gonna try and recreate that a little bit. Yeah, that, see? See how concentrated that looks? Alright, I'm gonna say it's not dots. We're gonna say it is a poltergeist. If I can see the ghost, I would take a photo. Alright, I wanna get the breaker back on because I wanna see the ghost during this hunt. And I also wanna see if it throws a whole bunch like a man I really need to learn this boulder guys and I can't see anything oh my god I can't even okay I'm gonna take photos to see where I'm going before I ran through here and I got really lucky this is creepy as hell by the way I got really lucky cuz my brightness like when it's pitch black it's pitch black and I can't really see where I'm going in the dark and there might be some kind of configuration <laughs> am I even going to the right side oh my god what am I this is the most horrifying way of playing this game I don't, I mean, if I take a photo of the ghost, it'll still disappear if it's a phantom. There's that little red light I need to be going to. But anyway, it's just, I don't know if there's a setting to where you can see better in the dark, but with the way I have it set up, I think it looks pretty good. And I, you, I think this is the perfect amount you should be able to see in the dark. I don't think there is a better setting to see more in the dark. It just comes down to knowing where you're going and like kind of adjusting your eyes and just also getting lucky. But maybe now that I've been in the dark, my sanity's a bit lower, but guess what? I do want to pull the tarot cards. I'm grabbing my light. I'm gonna grab the tarot cards in here. God, it looks like there's been stuff thrown everywhere. There were hunts earlier. But I'm taking... <laughs> Your back looked a little messed up there. So, I'm gonna pull the tarot cards in here. Yeah, you followed me back in here, didn't you? I wanna see if I can like loop the ghost a little bit around the island. Because it's just weird, I never realized, like, even on Leesdale, there's an island you can hide behind and... Break line of sight? Okay. See, she's... Uh, is she throwing... Oh my god, by the way. Is she throwing a lot? If I guess that's a lot for a poltergeist. I'm gonna have to, like, test against a non-poltergeist, but... Ah, uh, that's my guess. I don't know though, once again, it was could have been a ghost riding. I didn't get the dots, and that was the only other thing it could have been. No ghost orb, so please, Poltergeist. Yes, okay, so I'm just gonna have to see. I don't know why I didn't feel like that was a lot of throwing, but I'm just gonna have to compare with the regular ghost to see how much it throws. But, all right, I want to check this, two of three. All right, one more to go. Okay, so once again, the breaker's up in the attic, but we have fog, so. I'm going to do the same strategy and use the old thermometer. Oh god, I really need to remember to also listen. But I I know I could use the headlight or the night vision goggles, but I'm getting close to unlocking that stuff myself and that's why I'm doing these weeklies and also going to be playing a lot more and also going to be playing a ton during Halloween because I Halloween's going to be nuts by the way. I don't even fully know what I'm going to be doing, but there's going to be long content and all kinds of stuff for that. But for now, I just want to focus on getting that stuff unlocked and I just using it for myself. So the, we used the motion sensor a little bit, which was fun. But I'm going to just leave it and wait for myself to unlock it. And maybe we'll use it this game, you know, but I'm not focusing on using it just yet. I'm, I'm gonna leave it really I really just want to unlock it myself but I'm not against using it in these weeklies but that's what I mean I'm just not walking in here with them but we might still end up using something like the motion sensors again but I don't really want to use the night vision goggles because I feel like right now I want to focus on the weekly and I feel like the night vision goggles are gonna get me killed we used them in the first game and that was pretty fun wow so it's really crazy to me that this is still such a powerful thing to do no I didn't hear anything well, I feel like I hear things, but who knows. But yeah, I mean, as soon as I walk into a colder room, it's gonna drop. Is it the tarot cards again? Maybe it is just the tarot cards every time on this challenge, because I, I don't know if there's a way of knowing, but apparently each challenge does have its own custom settings to some degree. Like, this is, you know, three evidence and still... Oh, hello, bone. But it's still, like, professional. It's not really set up like Nightmare. Hmm, <laughs> okay. I do really need this cold room though. It's probably somewhere back upstairs, isn't it? All these rooms have been well into the tens, like 13, 14. 
Although that is out, or is it? It's strange. Uh, is this open? No. I guess I could still come back here. Looks like I gotta go walk through the house again. You know, when I was walking upstairs, I did kind of think I heard stuff, but it's so weird. Sometimes there's so many new sounds, and it's so weird muffled through walls, and... So, oh my god. I stepped on, like, the rug here, and it sounded different. Okay, time to go scan upstairs again. There is a hiding spot under there, though. Now my sanity. I've been in the dark this whole time. Come on, give us a sign. Oh, ten. That's the lowest I've seen. And uh, I asked for a sign, and you gave it to me. I'm gonna switch to the EMF. Oh, did I not even, like... I kind of briefly looked in... Did I not even... I think I, like, walked in here for a split second and didn't really scan it. And this room is pretty warm. Maybe you are another hallway ghost. Please. Don't be out here. You threw this. Oh my god. You're gonna make this last one an annoying one on me, aren't you? Now, did you turn that on? Yeah, and the breaker's not on. Okay, maybe this is your room. I walked in here for a second, but maybe I wasn't even looking at the... I think I may have been talking once again. So I'm gonna drop that. The breaker is nearby, thankfully. I heard that. I need to go check that for EMF. Can the breaker be on either side, or is it always on this side? I really should pay attention. Also, I noticed this gap through the world. I think that's because I changed my anti-aliasing. Okay, please, is this... There. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was green for some reason. Okay, I'm gonna turn the light to the attic on, and you're giving me dirty water. I really should turn the light to this hallway on. I really just want to go get more equipment. So yeah, I'm gonna drop this stuff, turn on this light, and go get more equipment. Oh god, that's a doorway. I should be using these <laughs> windows to see where I'm going. Alright, well, you know what? Sanity's actually, well, it's under 70s. I thought it was looking a bit better. Should I just leave Sanity as it is? Let's take this. Maybe we'll get lucky with dots. And if it touches a door, I definitely want to... Because we don't have salt, so that's going to be my only opportunity. I'm going to leave my sanity lower now that we have lights on, and I'm going to see how much I can get away with surviving, or how long I can not get hunted. As long as you're not a hallway ghost, because we just had one up here. I'm pretty sure the ghost could still be in this hallway. I know they removed, like, hall <laughs> hallway ghosts from high school and whatnot. Please turn that off. Did you touch a door? Here, pause that in the room. It is so nice to be able to pause that, because I know when they first added that, you couldn't pause it, and that would have been really annoying, so I'm glad that when I get to use it, it actually is pausable. Now this is a room that you really like, but are there ghost orbs in here? <laughs> Not seeing them. Usually they're pretty obvious, so if you don't see them, they're not here. No, I don't, I've been not using that tripod, so... Can I place it on the toilet? Can I place it in the toilet? Oh my god, I actually can, I can. There. Now, fingerprints. No fingerprints. No EMF5 either. Also, I've been in the dark. You're going down pretty low. I think I'm going to grab my light. I'm going to turn on the breaker. And then try and leave again and just go get more stuff because my sanity is so low. I think I'm just going to get hunted. And if there's somewhere to hide up here, I don't mind getting hunted and trying to listen to the ghost speed. Now, it's been turning the breaker off a lot. That makes me think it's a mare. Yeah, I'm afraid of really getting hunted here. Now, I don't know if I can rule out evidence. I'm pretty sure I can. So why not roll out UV, unless it just gave it to me here, which it did not. I'm gonna scan one more time. Oh yeah, I should have like, looked longer for that. Well, let's go back and see if I can get not hunted here. Okay, well actually, still above sanity. I, I don't know why I really thought I drained it. I'm the only thing, spirit box, and oh my god, do we have four cameras? I didn't even realize you could have four cameras. But I guess there's nothing else. Alright, so we will be using some more tier 3 stuff. I'm bringing these two motion sensors in just to have fun with them, and there's nothing really else to bring in. I'm bringing in the spirit box, so... Uh, we don't have a lead on this ghost. We haven't gotten hunted by it yet. 
Even with that poltergeist, I got kinda early hunted and somehow survived. Both those two games somehow I survived and ended up getting the ghost right, even though I really should have died. What about here and then maybe deep in the room? The only problem is, are you here? I can't really do much. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? Are you far? Are you away? Oh, is that sensing me? I don't think it's sensing me. No, I don't. I think it ignores me. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you <gasps> oh my god. I, I always forget how loud that is. Are you here? Are you friendly? I want to. I want to do creepy stuff like this. Where are you? Are you here? Slips away. Oh, this is, th this is why I love this game, is creepy stuff like this. Well, we got one evidence. I'm gonna officially turn that off. No EMF 5. No dots. What is happening with this one? <laughs> I gotta keep looking for something here. Wait, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Again, it, these tier 3 won't detect me, so those are just amazing. Unless it is me just walking through them. I don't think it is, though. Because yeah, now it's not doing it. So, yeah. Maybe it's down to freezing. I don't know what the hell else this could be. And it is down to freezing. So, twins, Henri or Moroi. Now, Moroi would have just cursed me. But what else? It's not UV. So, it's going to be MF. It's not going to be dots. Doesn't seem to be ghost orbs. <laughs> See, I bet this challenge really does favor ghost writing ghosts. Each one has been ghost writing. Oh, there's that fan. <laughs> Not the terrifying fan. So I'm gonna stay on this side of the room. I don't have candles either to test Onryo. Now, was that a twins, like, double? Well, let's rule out. We, we can't be dots, can't be UV. We've not seen ghost orbs, and we've not seen the EMF-5, and it's been doing so much stuff. So I think it is a Moroi. Yeah, we have no way of knowing if it's writing. Now, if it's Moroi, it will- Oh, we do have a way, because Moroi's gonna be fast if I'm low sanity. So, hmm. I could spend more time here with the ghost. But we're not gonna get anything. I don't think we're gonna get EMF-5 with how much stuff we've done. We've not seen the ghost orbs. There's no real point in me still scanning around for them. Unless they're back here. Alright, yeah, well, I had fun with that spirit box like that, and it's just so fun being able to communicate with the ghost. And that trailer, if you've seen it for the console version on the Xbox trailer, it's so ridiculous how, like, they're yelling about the ghost and stuff. So, I don't know, I just want the game to be closer to that, and for anyone new, the game isn't gonna be like that. And also, playing multiplayer, the game is way different, so... I'm really hoping, uh, when the game comes to console, I will be playing multiplayer here soon. Now you're- oh my god. EMF-5? With all this stuff, no EMF-5. I bet it's a Moroi, and now it's just doing crazy stuff. Oh, that noise is awful. Oh, please, dude. Okay, you know what? Just take me. Yeah, it's a Moroi. Because twins, that was faster than even the faster twins. Oh, so put in Moroi. And we're gonna see. This one was a lot nicer of a challenge. And that's what I mean. I... I didn't want this, like, easy of one. I've watched this is going to be wrong. Let's see. But, I like having a small map, but I just, I mean, that one was really easy, because it was, like, all tier 3 equipment, and you even had the tier 3 sanity. That one would have been a lot harder if you didn't have the tier 3 sanity, but still. And then there's the tier 3 photo cam and a 700 bonus, so, again, I skipped through it. But we're at level 70. I'm going to go on over here, and we're definitely going to look at this. Tier 3 camera. I'm gonna go ahead and get it. We, wow, it was 5,000. One of Boney's best SLR cameras, complete with a wider lens, higher image quality, and quick processing power. This top-of-the-range camera provides the lowest delay time between photos, that's good, allowing quick evidence gathering. Additionally, it's been modified to be less susceptible to paranormal entities causing interference with the screen during manifestation. Perfect. So, really just nicer all around, and that's the main thing, is being able to take photos back-to-back -back a lot quicker, because that was my main complaint. Alright. There it is, photo camera. So tier 3, finally. So we still have a lot of other tier 3 stuff in here to get to, and I know that poor tripod needs to get upgraded, but I'm more worried about the other stuff, but 
yeah, more weeklies like this will be good. And also, I'm going to be playing a lot more Nightmare, so we're going to hopefully start grinding some levels, some money, and get to that tier 3 equipment as we get closer to Halloween here. But there's another weekly challenge down, so I'm having fun checking these out. And like I said, I just really need them to be on like a small to medium map, not, you know, Zunny Meadows or High School back to back. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.